Despite my skepticism, we decide to sign up for a walking tour that starts at the most haunted hotel in Savannah, the 1790 Inn. She jumps out of that window head first backwards, still doesn't die upon impact. She wants an immediate death. She hemorrhages for over two and a half hours. Oh my God. That's when they carry her to room 204, that window to the left of the mannequin. Do you see the doorway there? That's room 204, the most haunted room at the Inn today, and the most requested room at the Inn today. <laughs> Are you all ready to head to the cemetery? Yeah, that's pretty Sure, cool. why not? Right. This is Colonial Park Cemetery, the worst yellow fever epidemic to occur in Savannah. It occurred in the year 1820. We lost about 10% of our population that year, and they wanted to dispose of the bodies as quickly as possible. They didn't know it was being spread by mosquitoes at the time. There was also a huge fear of being buried alive when you died of yellow fever. Towards the end of the disease, you went into a comatose state. There were several tests to see if you were still living but the test didn't always work. Right. They've actually found scratch marks on the inside of coffins Stop. proving that people were buried alive. So to relieve people's fears, when you died of yellow fever and were buried underground, they would attach a string or a rope to your finger that went up through a tube in the ground, was attached to a bell that was above ground. So if you were alive and your hand moved, the bell would ring and they could dig you back up. That is so freaky. So from this time in history is where we get such terms as dead ringer, Dead ringer. Saved by the bell. It wasn't oh, Zach Lord. Morris and his TV show. <laughs> and also graveyard shift. The family would hire a young boy to sit in the cemetery from the hours of 11 o'clock p.m. And listen for the bell. To 7 o'clock a.m. just listening for that bell. <laughs> exactly right. So they could dig their loved one back up. And what do you believe? Um, I actually believe that there's something to it all, whether it's angels, demons, spirits visiting from the dead. There's something going on. When I started doing this, no I was very demons. much a skeptic. We fought enough demons. But, yeah. Enjoy the rest of your stay in Spain. I hope you had a great Thank time you while so you were much. here. Thank yeah, you so much. Awesome. It was so nice meeting you all. Thank, Thank you. you. <laughs>